The Centers for Disease Control recommends people wear masks when they leave their homes, but it's not a requirement for the public, including for most grocery store employees and their customers. 10 News reporter Shannon Smith explains why you may not see every essential worker wearing the protective gear. When you go to the store, you see two types of people, those who wear a face mask and those who don't. Wearing a cloth mask in public helps, helps protect others and gives you a level of protection as well. The Knox County Health Department says it's a recommendation, not a requirement, but people want to see others taking health precautions seriously. And I was appalled that people were going to the grocery store with no mask, no gloves, uh, and that even the employees at the stores were not wearing masks and gloves. That's Dr. William Smith, CEO of Alliance for Multi-Specialty Research and a Knoxville cardiologist. He says it's unsafe for workers to go without PPE. This is exactly the kind of behavior that will, will keep coronavirus um, around. But Dr. Martha Buchanan, who leads Knox County's health department, says people are doing a pretty good job. I've really been impressed with the level of uh, conscientiousness I see in the grocery stores and places where I have to go to get my groceries. Um, you know, they're cleaning areas frequently, those high touch areas, and that's really important in reducing the risk for this disease. Big chain stores like Walmart, Kroger, and Pilot Flying J have all said they're providing masks for the workers who want to wear them. But again, it's not a requirement. The health department cannot force anyone to wear a mask. Under current CDC guidance, um, wearing a mask in public is simply a recommendation. Um, and uh, we'll continue to follow that guidance. Walmart and Food City are two chains working to install plexiglass protective guards at checkout aisles for employee and shopper protection, as well as reminders on the ground to stay six feet apart. Shannon Smith, 10 News.